Hey, Bear, how would you like to pick out our next tale of tales? You want to take a closer look at Green Lizards vs. Red Rectangles by Steve Antony? Awesome choice. Are you ever in the mood for something completely different? Because we are sometimes. And today, I've got just the thing. Green Lizards versus Red Rectangles by Steve Antony. This book is rad, super silly, very creative, and well worth a look. Let's dive in. The Green Lizards and the Red Rectangles were at war. <laughs> dum 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 dum. Dum, dum, dum. The green lizards tried their best to defeat the red rectangles. <laughs> what do you see the green lizards doing in this picture? Yeah, they're kind of like pushing against the red rectangles, just like Walter's pushing against my face, right? Yeah. <laughs> I wonder what the red rectangles are going to do. <gasps> but the red rectangles were smart. Take a close look at this picture. How does it show you that the red rectangles are very smart? What's their plan? What will happen when all the red rectangles domino into each other and the very last one comes toppling down? I guess you're on the lizard side, huh? The red rectangles tried their best to defeat the green lizards. Oh, that makes you upset because you're a green lizard? Walter's definitely siding with the lizards, I can tell. But the green lizards were strong! What are we fighting for? Asked one green lizard. Huh, that's a good question. But he was squashed! <gasps> and this led to the biggest war ever. They fought and fought and fought until they could fight no more. Enough is enough, said one red rectangle. The green lizards and the red rectangles gathered for a truce. And finally, they found a way to live peacefully together. Wow, the rectangles became a home. They made a giant building that was home for all the green lizards. And now look closely at the lizards. What do their faces look like? How are they feeling? They look happy. Yeah, they look happy to be living together with the red rectangles. <laughs> so fighting in the biggest war ever didn't feel good for the lizards and it didn't feel good for the rectangles. But living peacefully together, that worked out great. And they were all so much happier in the end. Well, it's a bit of a fairy tale, but I have to say, I like this book. Aw, that green lizard may be a little bandaged and bruised, but I can see there's a lot of love there too.